Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Tomb Raider 1 Remastered and we are going to tackle St. Francis Folly which is a kind of a demon of a level now I know a really really good trick in um, this actual area first of all we've got to deal with um, the king of the jungle The king of my jungle so anyway um i should do this properly and uh yeah okay i'll do it properly <laughs> just to show you like how to do it properly and how to do it the shortcut way so you want to pull that back once and you want to pull this forward twice because that now that one's over that that door will not close so to do this <laughs> properly you want to just walk in there basically now what I normally do is I jump over that tile but I'm not going to so I'll get my shotgun out because the door closes if you jump over it then that door won't close oh that was sweet you're dead oh you're dead too oh oh, oh that was beautiful all right so now there's two levers that we need to activate here push down and it will activate a third monkey but god knows where he is right now probably beyond me yeah he's over there he's no danger right now so draw that shotgun out go kill the last monkey oh, shit i missed the shot all right so now we've got to deal with pierre so you have to deal with pierre multiple times in all of these france levels but best for already is there so we need to get a lock on the bastard first. There he is. Right, we've got the lock. Okay. Now he's just going to keep running away, but we're just going to keep following and keep shooting him until he eventually disappears. God, his frog legs are pissing me off. Can you stay there, dude? Oh. I haven't even seen you. Oh, he keeps bloody moving. There. Right, he's gone. As soon as that life bar goes away, he's gone. All you got to do is break his plane of sight and then he's out of there. So that's the proper way to do it. And I didn't lose any life today. Nope. <laughs> so now we need to get the first secret of this level. And there's four secrets in this level in total. Now I'm going to do it properly. Unlike my low, unlike my no loads, no meds, were most recent attempt, I actually messed up on one of the secrets. I still activated it, but I didn't get the item, which is what I really bloody needed as well. So, oh, God's sake. Well, don't do what I just did there. You want to get the secret, you do it this way. Not my way, just then. <laughs> to the corner, a little bit, and boom. And this secret contains shotgun shells, and I believe it's a large med pack. Can't remember if it's small or large. It's a large. That's the large med pack. That's the shotgun shells. We really need to pro probably try saving shotgun shells in the next couple of levels because uh, you're gonna need them. I'll try. Not, I'll try to use them as least as possible, really, because the shotguns are so effective. It says large med pack on that pillar right there. Let's make sure we grab it. We don't need it. We're not going to need them. I'm not going to use them, but you know, oh yeah, we have to collect them. There's actually a bunch of items in this level. Hopefully, I don't miss any. Anywhere is it not? No. <laughs> Oh well, yeah, I know we're practically 99% of it is, but uh, I might forget. Right, so you want to go down here backwards, and I'll show you why. So right now you're going down, right? You need to hold the action button now. Keep holding it, just don't let go. Then you'll grab. Then you need to pull yourself up, and it's going to let you go down, but hold the down button and the square, and you'll go in there perfectly. Now then just do a normal jump back. Now, last time I messed up on that. 
I did I so I missed the shotgun shells here and the small med pack in the adjacent corner. What a big word. So now we need to go back out right in front of us now to get the third secret second secret, sorry. No wait. Yeah, third secret. There's an alligator there, so don't let him freak you out. He might take a bite out of our bum, but he didn't. Nice. Now this is the third secret. Now we're gonna get the fourth secret very very soon as well. And that involves you to well one concentrate and take care because we take force damage and it is timed um oh shit. Go away. You took a chomp out of our bloody face. So this fourth secret is timed. So just be careful. No is a bloody alligator. Oh crap. Right, he's dead. Jump turn in the air, make it go quicker. So now we are in the big area of St. Francis Farley. So I'm gonna do this properly. Gonna do it as I should. Stepping onto one random tile, can't remember which one it is. Activate three bats, let's get rid of them. There's one annoying bands that will piss me off. So there's four doors and four keys need to get. So that's one door open, that's a Thor door. Now we need to activate a fourth secret. To do that, we need to jump on this tile right here. Now this, the secret is open right now. The timer will start as soon as you break this plane. I wish the best of luck to you. Good luck. Jump, roll, fall off, take damage. Jump, forward roll. Two bats, dispose of them quickly. Jump, fall down. And just made it. Alright. That's the fourth secret of four. And that's Magnum Clips and the large med pack. Now I'll be back in just one tick. Oh, right, now, let's go and continue this level. Now, <clears throat> we're going to work our way from the bottom, all the way to the top. So this is the Atlas room. Atlas door, sorry. Now, we're going to go up here, and we're going to collect some magnum ammo, and we're, we're going to shoot this bat straight in his eyeball. Roll, bang dead. I used way more pistol ammo than I wanted to there. Good job, it's unlimited. Bunch of phones going off right there in the background. <laughs> and so we want to walk all the way to the corner here. Take a step back. One, two, jump, and boom. So now we need to go activate another door, which is right here. Now this is the Neptune door. If you will let me activate this. Pull the fecking lever. Thank you. So now we need to well, keep going up, but on top of the Damocles room, there's a large med pack just sitting there. Hello, large med pack. Not at the moment. Uh, Why? Because I am fine. Okay, so now we've done three or four doors, we need to activate one more door. And that door is a Damocles room, which is the most dangerous room of all of them. Possibly. Maybe two bats, bang, bang. 
Now there's gonna be this annoying bat now is activated. But because we're doing an uh, Oh my god, that was so close to death there. Did you guys see that? So there's going to be Where's this fucking bat? Gotcha. So pick up that small med pack. No, I believe I opened the door. Yes, it is. So now we have all doors open. Brilliant. Let's go in the mall. Now there'll probably be a few more bats to deal with there, but you know, that's no problem. Now this is, has to be done in one breath. So it's going to suck you down. Don't like. Don't be scared, basically. Don't be a little girl. So then you're going up here. Oh God's sake! And this door will give us access to the key. As the gate is blocking it, this level will open the gate, like you can hear there. Oh, excuse me. And the key is here. You think right now, crikey, I'm on less than half health, like breath, but it gives you plenty. Big ass pool though, right? Yeah. That's Neptune, though, God of the Sea, if you believe in it. Right, so now, if it doesn't stop the pool glitching me. We're going to go do the next room, which is just below here. And that is the Atlas room. Now you want to equip your shotgun. 15 shots, I expect to have 14 in a moment too. Monkey, monkey, monkey. Dead monkey. Now be fucking careful here, because this boulder right here is going to come at you. Until you break a certain tile, which is that one. Just stay there, you'll be perfectly safe. And yes, there's a small med pack there, which we will grab it now. Right, let's move on. So, the key that we need is just up here. Oh, for God's sake. Right, so that's the Atlas key. Now we need to go into the Thor room. I can guess what you've got in there, right? Now right now, as soon as you do two doors and you get the key, you now activate Pierre. He's near there, he's now down below, plotting the scheme to probably kill us. But is it going to work? Of course it probably will, but not right now. Right, now a safe way down there. And we've got Damocles room just over there. But you you can't just walk in right now, you gotta do this. So you wanna hug the right side and dive and you'll be perfectly safe. Now don't get hit by Mjolnir, which is Thor's hammer. Now to save time on the speed run, you just wanna push this block once. We got some epic box um, pushing music right now. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Okay, so yeah. Sorry? You said this was six minutes. Oh, that was the last mission. Oh, it was doing six minutes. Yeah, I thought it was doing six minutes. This one's a pain in the ass. I'm going to get some out of the way. There's a small med pack up here. And then we need to go to the left. Run and jump. A bit of a scary jump, actually, to be honest with you. 
then we'll, we'll be able to get the Thor key. And now we just need one more key, which is the Damocles room, which is probably the most dangerous one. I'll show you why. Alright, so we need to go back in the Thor room, so be careful, we have to do the same thing. Without a single touch. Now the Damocles room is to the right hand side of the, in the corner. He's straight and right, and he didn't hit, appeared to not hit us, so that's good news. So the Damocles room is full of swords at the top, but don't be scared of them just yet, because they're not actually activated until you pick up the key, which is in here. Now, you think that, you'll think there's probably nothing up here, but there's actually two items here. There's a small map pack and some shotgun shells. Been getting a lot of shotgun shells recently. We currently have 16, so maybe not a lot. <laughs> All right, so now the swords have been activated. So now, from now on, we are walking, and you'll see why. As soon as you break one tile, it's just going to come right at you. So you just want to take your sweet ass time. Maybe another one coming to my left. No. No, you can get rid of two swords here. You want to bury this corner there. And stay there. See? Both are just coming down. And we're still safe. So, no joking. Always. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That sword scared the crap out of me. You just want to take your damn time. Walk it. Stop. One, two. Now there's two more swords we activate, which we can just walk past because they ain't going to touch us anymore. See, look at that. So now we're at the Damocles room. Now we need to kill the two lions and Pierre. We need to get lock on Pierre first, more than anything. That's a lion. There he is. Now we've got a lock in. As soon as we've got the lock, she'll always aim until we see him. Then she'll shoot. But he's playing silly buggers at the minute. Come on, Pierre. Oh, he's gone. That's good news. Now we can just take care of the lions. Okay, I'm just going to do it this way. Laura, put your guns away. One down. Yeah, the other one. Right now he's dead, so now everything is dead. We've got all the items. Let's just find out if we do or not. 19 of 19. Perfect. Each key you go up to, or each block you go up to, will give you the representative key. After this, we're going into one of my favourite missions, the Colosseum. Don't know why it's my favourite. One of my favourite. One of my favourites. It just is. And now the Neptune key. Then we can get out of here. So they have it, 19, 19, 4 of 4 secrets, 19 pickups, 0 health packs used. So I'll see you in the Colosseum. Peace out.